Hey guys, today we're going to be talking about Ugin. Ugin is a native to the plain of Tarkir, where his magic, the transmutation of energy into matter, is responsible for elemental dragon storms that once raged through the plain, giving birth to its dragons. This magic was deviated from the study of energetic patterns of the entire planes, their creation, destruction, and renewal. And he has applied these universal principles to creating his own form of magic. Ugin was the mastermind of the trio of planeswalkers, including Sorin, Markov, and Nahari, that lured the Adrazi to Zendikar to imprison them with the Eye of Ugin. Over the course of 40 years, the planeswalkers prepared Ugin's plans creating a massive network of stones known as hedrons, powered by ley lines and coated by draconic ruins. When the Adrazi finally arrived on Zendikar, Ugin's part was to combat the Adrazi with his own colorless magic, the magical key to unlocking the eye. Thousands of years later, after the Adrazi was sealed, Ugin encountered and fought the elder dragon Nicobolas, who had tracked the spare dragon to his home plane of Tarkir. The two planeswalkers waged a titanic battle, leaving Ugin nearly dead. Boles dug deep into Ugin's mind for information about the Adrazi in their prison. His purpose accomplished, Boles departed, leaving the grievously wounded Ugin to die. However, although physically dead, the dragon spirit had not departed, and found its way into the mind of a planeswalker, Shalkan Vol. Shalkan was played by Ugin's whispers in his head. 1280 years after the dragon's death, Shalkan later discovered that the whispers were Ugin's psychic plea across time and space for help. Ugin's rescue. Shalkan Vol was drawn back to his home plane of Tarkir by the whispering of Ugin's spirit in his head. While there, he was able to travel back in time 12,080 years using Ugin's Nexus, a spiritual nexus surrounding Ugin's bones. The Nexus transported Sarkon back in time just before the battle between Ugin and Nicobolas. Using a shard of Hedon containing Ugin's life force, Sarkon created the crucible of the spirit dragon to save Ugin and therefore therefore altered the fate of the entire planes.